Hello, and welcome to another episode of Exact Tax, brought to you by Actionable Insights. My name is Seth Harrison, and today I want to talk about the sketch template gallery in X1. We taught a class last week, and there was actually a Xactimate Tips and Tricks meeting this morning amongst trainers, and I realized that the class last week didn't know that this existed in general, and that there was some clarification or confusion in the Tips and Tricks meeting to clarify if uh, the sketch template gallery still existed in X1. So I thought, what better way to shoot an exact hack about something that is out there that is super valuable that people either aren't sure about or don't know how to find or don't know exactly what it is. So without further ado, I have an X1 estimate open here. And I'm going to come to my sketch tab, estimate sketch tab. Uh, coming from the tools, I'm going to move to options here. And I'm going to come here to the import. And when you look at import, historically, many people use the import underlay image especially those using the floor plans from Matterport and whatnot. Uh, but here is where you're gonna find the sketch templates. Now, when you click this, it's going to bring up this window here. This is the online sketch gallery. And as you can see here, as I scroll through, there are numerous sketches that are already completed. That's right, these are done. Done sketches that you can download, import uh, into Xactimate with the data transfer tool, and then simply load them up and drop them in. Make any adjustments as you need to along the way. As you'll know, many of these were created back in version 27.0, but good news, uh, the 27.0 files, the SKX template files, sketch template files work in X1. Uh, so let's take a look here. I'm gonna go ahead and download uh, you win this uh, staircase here. And I'm now going to actually close my estimate because I want to go to uh, here, to my main screen. I am going to go to the Tools tab and the Data Transfer. As you can see, I've already selected my Downloads folder to look for the data, and I want to import this into my Xactimate, this sketch template that I downloaded. And I am going to select the data, jump down to the sketch template file, and we're going to go find the UWIN uh, one step that we did. As you can see, Import Successful. I will jump back now to my uh, estimate that we were working in here. Bring it on up, bring it on up, there it is. Uh, there, we're, there we are, here I'll move this out a little bit so we get that full screen experience once more. So smooth, so smooth. All right, uh, let's jump back to the sketch tab now, go to options once more, and instead of going to import, we're gonna go to load template. I'm gonna hit that drop down box. You can see I have no sketch templates that I've used in this project thus far. So I'm gonna hit template list. And I will see as I scroll down here, the UWIN uh, one step that I just downloaded from the sketch template gallery, loaded it up, clicked, and I'm done. Now I can make any warranted adjustments that would be necessary to this. But if I check it out in 3D, I have a nice straight staircase that turns into this uh, turn skin, this nice turn here. So already pre-made and done, didn't have to do anything. But if I want to make any edits from here, I can. So hopefully this helps. If you ever come across a scenario, a difficult sketch that you are not sure about, you're not sure how to do, first off, head to Xactimate Ninjas. That's our Facebook group where you can ask questions about sketching, line items, scoping, etc. Otherwise, jump to the sketch gallery. See what is out there that already exists that you could be leveraging so that you don't have to go through the arduous task of trying to create a really difficult sketch that's already been done before and is ready for you to use right now. I uh, hope this helps. Please, if you could, give us a like, share this video. Uh, everything helps along the way, and uh, we'll be seeing you soon. Thank you.